First of all, your reaction to Nigel Farage stepping down? Well, I, I, I want to be generous. Um, he spent 20 years pushing for a referendum. We had the referendum and um, uh, it was won by 17 and a half million people and he, he, he played a role in that. And, um, you know... But you're pleased to see him go? Well, I'll, I'll be honest. Um, six months ago, I was talking about the need for, for change. Um, I, I do think all parties um, benefit. It may not look like it today, this week, but all parties ultimately benefit from having these internal democratic inclusive contests because it's a way of generating new ideas and allowing the most able to get to the top. Don't hold back. You tweeted a smiley face when he announced Nigel Farage who was stepping down. I tweet smiley faces all the time. I'm very optimistic. I tweeted <laughs> a smiley face when I woke up first thing this morning. So you're happy about it? Uh, there is a huge opportunity here. The uh, cartel parties in Westminster have for years taken for granted their electorates. 70% of Labour MPs represent constituencies where a majority of people wanted to leave the EU. And with the noble exception of people like Gisela Stewart, most Labour MPs are fundamentally out of touch with the views. And that's a huge opportunity for us. And a huge